KSLA News 12 is your station getting your students ready to take the Louisiana Educational Assessment Program. It's called LEAP as we know it. Joining us live by Zoom this morning is JJ Stalkup from Houghton High School. Thank you so much for joining us. Oh, good morning. Good morning. morning. So everybody wants to know what's the best way to prepare for the day of testing. Um, they prepare for the leap all year long mm -hmm. or all semester long in the case of high school that's on the block schedule. So it's I'd like for them not to think of it as just that big moment. They've been preparing for it. And so now it's just the, the final task that they have to complete. So I'd like for them not to get too worried. Mm -hmm. um, they know more than they think they know because they've learned it all year and just treat it. Um, it's an important test, but just not to really stress out about it. So just treat it like a regular day. Make sure you're getting plenty of sleep the mm -hmm. night before, eating a good meal, and just waking up bright-eyed, bushy-tailed, and ready to go. Ready to go. Right, right. The regular sleep may be different for teenagers. I mean, I know that we have teenagers that are staying up probably later than, than they should, so <laughs> I, would, I would suggest that they not treat it as a regular day in that sense and, and that they get to bed, maybe turn the technology off a little bit earlier at the night before and um, eat, a, eat a good breakfast, but maybe not so big that it makes them uh, nauseous the next day because they do get nervous. There's a lot, um, there's a little bit of pressure for a high school leap mm -hmm. test because they are required to pass those in order to graduate. Wow. So tell us about like when you're doing the math portion, whether you're in the third grade or up into high school, can you bring a calculator or are the calculators provided? I know a, a lot of parents wanted to know that. Um, and, and we we provide those calculators to students. The, the students are using those calculators all year long okay. in their math classes um, it, in Bossier Parish, at least. Um, and I'm sure the same is true in every school district. And um, we want them to be very comfortable um, with their calculators that they use. So, so they're using them and they've been trained to use them to complete the task that's required of them all year. Um, there is also a built-in calculator called Desmos okay. for the math portion um, at the high school level. And students are also trained on how to utilize that tool that's built into the test. So are they using the paper-based test or the computer-based test? At, at the high school level, it's all computer-based. All computer-based, okay. Everything we do is computer-based at the high school level now, except AP testing. Okay. Oh, wow, okay. Well, thank you so much for joining us this morning and yes. giving us all that good information. I know that our parents that are watching right now are saying, okay, this is good. We can mm -hmm. get through this. Yes, and it's helping me out a lot, too. I have a third grader taking it for the first time. Thank you, Ms. Stalkup, for joining us this morning. Um, no problem.